Hello, today I will be talking about movie review number 514, and this movie is called Shred Forever After, also known as Shred 4. Shred Forever After is a 2010 film directed by Mike Mitchell. Mike Mitchell. This is the fourth installment in the Shred franchise. From Universal Pictures and DreamWorks Animation SKG, I saw this movie on July 30th, 2022 at City Bay Cinemas Kenwood in Kenwood, Ohio. So, Ron settled into married wife and fully domesticated, Shred begins to mourn for the days when he felt by the real ogre. Duped into signing a contract with devious Rumpelstiltskin, he finds himself in an alternate version of Far, Far Away, where old girls are being hunted, Rumpel still can rules, and he, and he and Fiona have never met. Shrek must find a way out of the contract to restore his world and reclaim his true love. So, this takes place after the events of the third film, where Shrek is back to the swamp with Fiona, and they have three kids. So, once settled into Mary life and fully domesticated, Shred is beginning to long for the days when he felt like a real ogre, and he has one wish. He wishes that he has one that he can have one day to feel like a real ogre again. Well, devious Wampus Gilson made, uh, has written out a contract for Shred to have this day of being a real ogre again. Shred decides to sign the contract, and at first it all goes well, until Shred finds out what the contract was really for. Because of the contract, Rumpus Stilson becomes king, old girls are being hunted, Shred, Shred's friends do not know him, like Donkey and Puss in Boots, not even his true love Fiona. And Fiona is like a female warrior in this film, who is leading a, an army of ogres to try to take down the king. Take down the king. Um. So Shrek must must find a way out of the contract in time to restore his world and reclaim his true love. The only problem is, will he get his friends to to listen to him? and make them believe that what he's saying to them is tr true. That is, he is their friends, and he needs their help. So, Wumpus Stilston is the villain in this film, and he made Shred sign a contract where, where Shred feels like a real ogre then, but unfortunately, Shred has no idea that Wumpus Dilston tricked them. Wumpus Dilston got what he wanted to become king of Far Far Away. And Donkey and Puss and Bruce and Fiona does not know Shred at all, even though Shred knows all of them. Um, like I said, Donkey does not know Shred at all. Fiona becomes a female warrior. And Puss in Boots, well, he becomes a bigger cat. But yeah, this was a pretty good movie, and it, and it definitely has a message. Be careful what you wish for, because you never know what's going to happen. I know that I can understand why Shred decided to sign the contract, but I also write how Shred realize that he does have everything. He has Fiona, he has kids, he has friends. And Shrek thought at first that maybe that wasn't what he wanted, but then realizes that that is what he wanted all along. And I won't say what happens, but it's a pretty good movie. I remember seeing this movie in 2010 at, I believe it was the Weebo Cinema video in Mason, Ohio. 
I think it was around Father's Day weekend, but I do believe I remember seeing this film. And I don't know if it's going to happen. There was originally supposed to be five Shrek movies, but apparently DreamWorks decided to make the fourth film, the last film. But DreamWorks have also said that there could be a fifth Shrek film on the way. After DreamWorks just announced that there will be a country painter four, maybe there'll be a Shrek five. Who knows? Well, considering that there will be a Pilsen Boost 2 radio this year, hopefully that would give fans hope that there will be a Shrek 5. I want there to be a Shrek 5. I hear that if they do a Shrek 5, they will explain how Shrek got to be at that swamp in the first place. I want to see how that goes. But yeah, we'll see what happens. But yeah, Shrek Forever After was a pretty good movie. So that's my movie review of Shrek Forever After, aka Shrek 4. Hopefully there'll be a Shrek 5. Please stay tuned for my next movie review. Alright, goodbye.